Tornado Alley is loosely defined as the states that make up the central plains of the United States. This is where an average of 1,200 tornadoes impact thousands of Americans every year. New research indicates that the location itself may be shifting east, a topic Mark Robinson and I covered in an episode of Storm Hunters back in 2019. I, like you guys, chase storms for weeks at a time out in the Great Plains every year. And over the past four or five years, I've kind of noticed that in the heart of Tornado Alley, Kansas, Texas, Oklahoma, we've sort of seen a fewer number of tornadoes. And I started asking the question, like, are there trends in the very local areas where we usually see tornadoes? Have they moved? Are we still getting them? Is this just me, my perception sort of thing? We started digging into the data a little bit, and lo and behold, we started to find these very subtle shifts of counts of tornadoes away from those areas of the Great Plains and further to the east in the United States, where they still get a lot of tornadoes, but we see we see them now happening more frequently. We have evidence that it's happening with the data. The question right now is why it's happening. And our leading hypothesis is that it's climate. So there is a there's a shift in, in climate. Now, the question then becomes, is it due to humans or is it due to natural variability? The shift is real. In addition to seeing a shift in where tornadoes are located, we are also seeing less days with tornadoes, but more days with clustered tornado events and possibly even bigger tornadoes. We do know also that there's evidence that the jet stream pattern has changed over the last 40 years and the, it's become more variable also. The thing we're missing is a link that says that the changes that we see have seen in the jet stream pattern actually would produce the kinds of changes we see in the, in the frequency of the tornado occurrence. And that's just a, that's a hard problem to answer.